So I, I offered to speak to her off the record. Not now on the podcast. I know it's the hottest podcast in the world, but now on the podcast. I say, yo, whatever, whatever. I just want to really figure out what happened because, like, you know, we're all looking like, damn, you look healthy. Like, what happened? Like, you know what I mean? Just trying to get, like, the vibe of everything. She first hits me and she says, I ain't talking to nobody. Like, I got a lawyer, blah, blah, blah. My lawyer said, don't do no talking, no interviews. I said, well, it's not an interview. Like, we're not, we, we would talk privately. Um, I don't know if she said she was thinking about it, so whatever. Anyway, she hits me back and she says, if you want to talk to me, it's $5,000. What the fuck? This is what I be trying to tell y'all niggas, man. Like, none of these chicks care about these niggas, bro. Like, I'm thinking she distraught and hurt, and she just don't want to get blamed. Man, she said, give me five bands, I'll talk to you, nigga. Five bands? Nigga, I don't give a fuck what happened. I'm going to give it a thousand with you. Five bands? You stupid as fuck. With the comments, DJ Academics pretty much just said that he found the woman that Kevin was with, and five bands is what she's asking for to talk about this now. I don't know if you think or you decided that Kevin died alone, or if he died with a, a bad broad in his arms. It was pretty clear that she's willing to monetize the situation and give details. So you could take that for what you will. But I think this is hella interesting here with this entire thing going down. DJ Academics did find the woman. He had a conversation with her, and she wants five thousand dollars to talk about this. What do you think about this situation? I just want to drop this to you really quickly. Also, I want you to pay attention that what you see this stream uh, being right here the stream that you're watching is dj academics live stream where it's mainly focused around hip-hop the age demographic and group is like 15 to, to like 20 that's his main demographic and group and they're talking about kevin samuels right now so i want you to know going forward that this is the new generations or this will be the new generations talking points that no simp anti sympathy like that's that's already pretty established in that generation right now and that is thanks to these old generations trying to put in this pimp type mindset in these young kids where now you have a 30 year old man talking to 15 year old kids about a 56 year old man who didn't die alone I see